make the good times last. I didn't get you a job at the penalty box so you could goof around and get fired. Chill, just familiarizing myself with the gear. You're gonna get me in trouble. I see you're familiarizing yourself with the gear. Good man. What are you doing with that net, Masterson? Get your mind on the game. Now, have you been showing young Jonesy here the plays? I've been trying to. Well, you're learning from the best. Masterson has the highest sales rate of any assistant customer coach at the penalty box. Carry on. Thanks a lot. Oh, uh, come on, Jen. You heard the man. You're the best, and I'm just your humble student. Okay, so let's say you've made the sale and the customer is going to buy this net, for mm. instance. You have to scan the product code at the cash or ring it in manually. Are you listening to me? <clears throat> yeah, you code the scan thing. Jonesy, pay attention. I bet I could ring it in from here. Are you crazy? You're gonna bust the cash register. What does the sale show? 2160. And how much is the cost of the bat and ball with tax? 2160. <sighs> wah, wah, wah. <sighs> If a customer is returning merchandise, they have to have a receipt. <laughs> Jonesy, you have to know all this stuff. I just go with my gut. And my gut is saying, I'm ready to get my sale on. You think so? No so. I guess I could try assisting you on a sale. Solid. I'll take that guy. Hold on a sec. Uh. Can I help you? Yeah, I'll take a can of tennis balls. Sure, did I tell you about our special promotion? Two cans of tennis balls for the price of two. Uh, sure, okay. Jen will ring those in for you. Jonesy! <laughs> oh. Hi, Wyatt. Hey, you look different today. Oh, good different or bad different? You could never look bad. Oh, maybe it's the bandana. Yeah, that's it. Looks cool. You think? <laughs> Thanks. What's happening, guys? Hey, my old bandana. <laughs> Haven't seen that in a while. You're wearing Chad's bandana? Oh, yeah. I never got around to giving it back to him after we broke up. You and Chad used to be... Boyfriend and girlfriend. Yeah, you knew that. No, I'm pretty sure I didn't. Oh, well, so now you know. So now I know. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me? Just a second, dude. Going for 100 in a row. Cool. What are you shooting now? Three. Oh. Can I help you? Do you sell hockey tape? Hockey tape? I'll bet we do. Jen, do we sell hockey tape? Excuse me. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Where would I find some? Jen, where is it? On the shelf beside you. Well, that was easy. Great. Thanks. Have you tried these new titanium hockey sticks? Chicks love titanium. I'll take it. Good choice. Let's ring her up. Here you go. No, it's stupid. He's done that at every stand in the food cart we've been to today. Bummer. Would you be a sweetheart and watch my Stanley for me while I go cry? I mean, powder my nose. No problemo. Thanks. Bye. Maybe this isn't such a good idea. So what if Serena and Chad used to date? So what? She's still wearing his stuff. It's like she's still, I don't know, his girl. Yeah, if it were like 1962. Don't sweat it. Buy her a new bandana and put it on her head. Problem solved. Oh, and why don't you write Wyatt's girlfriend across it while you're at it? That's not a bad idea, thanks. Ugh, wouldn't you hate to be a guy and be so confused all the time? I heard that. What? We're tied for sales? How could that be? You don't even try. 
I think it's a combination of things. My incredible skill and your career going downhill. What do you mean downhill? Face it, you peaked too soon. I what? No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You're a peak too sooner. I am not a peak too sooner. <laughs> Excuse me. I'll handle this. You go plan your retirement dinner. I'm going rock climbing. Right this way, sir. Whoa! Ooh. Masterson, that's clipping from behind. Two minutes in the box. <sighs> peak too soon. Would you like a bag for that kayak? Attention all assistant coaches. This young man here sells with a lot of heart. That kayak was for display only, and he still sold it to a customer. Is it not a functioning kayak? Oh, no, sir. It's fine. Just make sure to bring a life jacket. Now, go get him. Son, how about lunch? Talk turkey. Oh, boy, that's sticking somewhere. Jonesy! Dude, can I have some marshmallows for the fire? For the... <gasps> <laughs> Looks like I have to keep my eye on you, huh? Yes, you do. So, okay, what do you usually do with babysitters? Make them cry. <laughs> do you think she'll like it? It has hockey sticks on it. Yeah, so? Uh, did you buy the first one you saw? Yeah, a bandana's a bandana. Wyatt, you have a lot to learn about fashion. You should take it back. Well, I say she'll love it. So, what are you into besides making babysitters cry? Hitting things. I'm down with that. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? Babysitting. All right, then. Carry on. Did you get that ugly bandana to her yet? No, I'm waiting for the right moment. Hey, dudes. <laughs> What's with Junior? His mom left him with me so she could go to the washroom. That's so sweet. Three hours ago. We broke things. Little dude's got a good arm. Listen, Jonesy, it's stupid for us to compete for sales at work. You're right. Guys are just naturally better at that stuff than girls. Excuse me? No, I meant we should work as a team. Yeah, and you shouldn't feel bad about asking for help. Uh, hold on. You don't actually think guys are better at anything because they're guys, do you? No, I don't think that. I know it. Right, guys? I don't know. I guess. Face it, the male race is braver, faster, stronger. We're superior. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Let's see what you've got. Okay, pick something, anything, and we'll do it better than you. Fine. Staring contest, me and Jude. Oh, you're going down. Right, Jude? Uh... Yeah. First one to blink loses. And go! Ah <laughs> Nice! <laughs> How come you folded so quickly? I forgot what we were doing. I'm thinking of four words. I told you so! Not so fast there. Best two out of three. Fine. We'll even let you pick the challenge this time. <laughs> A blind lemon chugging contest. That's pure lemon juice. That's right, you chicken. I'll do it. You're on. You were made for this. It'll be a piece of cake. Ready? Go! <laughs> That's good lemon juice. One more. He's gonna choke. Come on, dude. You can take her. It's just lemon juice. You can do this. Disqualified. We have a winner. I'm going to take Stanley back to stick it. Be back pronto. Three out of five. He says best three out of five. Don't know when to give up, huh? Okay. Have I got a challenge for you.
Here's the dare. Go inside and buy a Miss Teen Girl magazine, a pink lipstick, and tampons. Why do I have to do it? It's your turn. Now represent, dude. Oh, you're going down. I can't do it. I knew it. Yeah. Big chicken. Big, big chicken. chicken. Why is, is the big chicken? chicken. <laughs> I can't do it. Wah, wah, wah. <sighs> I knew we'd be better than you, <laughs> but this is embarrassing. Okay, you Nancys, one more contest. No way. We already beat you three times. Well, fine. If you're chicken, you're on. We choose winner take all. Bring it on. Hey, guys, guess what? Stanley's mom came back and she paid me 20 bucks. I'm watching him again tomorrow. Here's the challenge. Whoever can eat 30 stickets and then ride the vomit comet without barfing wins. Take your time. That was a lot of stickets. Mm. Okay, here we go. Okay. There goes a brave man. One for the team, buddy. You didn't lose it. Give us some room. Uh... Okay, just do what you have to do to keep those sticky chunks down. <laughs> yes, Jen Toster cookies. <gasps> the guys win. Fine, you won. That's five out of seven. I'm sorry. <laughs> didn't you hear the challenge? It was all or nothing. Remember, <laughs> winner take all. Guys rock. <laughs> you know it. <laughs> In your face. <laughs> Have a good day. Hubba hubba. Good morning. Yeah, yeah. Got a riddle for you. What group of people are better at things than girls? I'm not in the mood. The answer is guys! Oh, right. You lose repeatedly, score one win on a fluke, and then declare yourself the winner. Being gracious in defeat is a sign of maturity, you know. What are those? Knitted soccer ball cozy. I thought we'd score a home run with these, but we didn't sell a single one. But then again, we didn't have Jonesy on our team. You move these and you'll make the Hall of Fame in no time. Thanks, Coach. You make me want to be a better salesman. You suck. Masterson! Look, I'm sick of hearing how great Jonesy is. I know. Two minutes. Are you hungry? Huh? Want to grab a bite? Sure. Let's grab a bite. Cool. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I got something for you. A present? Oh. Wyatt, this is sweet, but it has hockey sticks on it. Cool, huh? I knew you'd like it. Actually, it's really not my style. Just try it on. Unless you only like to wear bandanas that Chad gave you. Oh, is that what this is all about? Obviously, Chad has better clothes for your head than I do. Obviously, someone has Chad issues. That went well. Whoa, word must have got out about the new cheesy fish stickets. Are you the daycare facilitator? Uh, no. I think there's been some kind of... We're all willing to pay $7 per hour per child. Hmm. Welcome to Dude Daycare. Ah! <laughs> another fantastic lunch, Jonesy. Masterson, get to work! Brought you back a little something from our lunch. Free crappy restaurant mints. How thoughtful. <sighs> I better get back. Still have a few hours to beat that one week all time sales record. <sighs> yeah! <laughs> 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 ah! Little dudes! Listen up. Field trip. <laughs> hey, ice cream is for eating. <laughs> Jonesy, I'm being swarmed by kids. How do I make kids stop? Give them some chocolate. That'll calm them down. <laughs> right. Calm down, little monkey dudes. Have some more chocolate. 
<laughs> New plan. Let's go see Uncle Wyatt. Hey, you didn't call me last night. I was busy. So, you're wearing Chad's bandana again, huh? That would make a great country tune. Why don't you wear the one I got you? Wyatt, I want to wear this bandana. I'm sorry if it bothers you. No, no, it doesn't bother me, no. Yeah, okay, it bothers me. CDs, all right! Don't steal <laughs> anything, mini dudes. What are you doing here? I'll catch up with you later, okay? You gotta help me. These little dudes will not chill out. <laughs> 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 nice accessorizing, Jude. Uh, you boys need some help? No, it's all under control. Silly ass. They're the superior race, remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Unless you're here to increase my commissions, keep it moving. You have to help us watch them. <laughs> <laughs> Those kids are nuts. Maybe Caitlin and Nikki were right. We do need their help. What? You can't show them any weakness. We can do this. They're just kids. But these kids are killing us, dude. Oh, no, where are they? Hey! Excuse me. Stop it. Please stop. Help! Help! Little dudes! Stop! What do you need? I think it would be smart if we split them up amongst us. Sure. Give me one. Watch that one. He's a biter. Or maybe it's that one. I'll take Stanley here. We have an understanding already. Right, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Sit. Stay. You know, a girl wouldn't have to lock a kid up just to control him. Please, kids are a breeze. He likes <laughs> it in there. <laughs> I think your breeze has blown. <laughs> hey, kid! Could I borrow your bandana so I can play cowboys with this kid? Sure, I guess. Thanks. <laughs> I'll get that. You have to come pick this kid up and return her before I get fired. I can't. I don't know where their moms are. We're stuck with them till like 8 o'clock tonight. Well, then Jonesy's taking them. <laughs> you really have a talent for wrecking stuff, dude. Jude, just meet me back at the penalty box. You're still sure you don't need help? All you need to know about children is a bit of simple psychology. Chocolate makes them happy. Well, that explains this. Looks like he's been happy all over the store. Ah! Quick, help me clean these up or hide them in the stock room. Oh, I'm sorry. I would, but I'm on my break. <laughs> ah! You have to come see this. Does it have anything to do with the guy screwing up? Royally. So, Jonesy, what's Coach freaking out about? What? Nothing. Masterson, why is there chocolate all over my office? That's a really good question. Maybe your star MVP can answer that. Jonesy, I need a word with you. Ah! Ah! Whoa there, little tight. Oh! Oh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! oh I... <laughs> the kids are just uh, excited to see a real live legend such as yourself. Jonesy, well, what are you doing with these kids? I'm watching them. It's daycare. Daycare? Oh, we don't stand for moonlighting. I'm afraid you're toast. You're out of here. You're fired. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> you know, somehow I told you so just doesn't cut it right now. <laughs> Help. Did you hear something? Gee, I'm not sure. It sounded like a cry for help. Help? Oh, but it couldn't be. From who? I don't know. Everything is under control here. Help! If you need our help, boys, we're only too happy to give it. Right, girls? Sure. Of course. If you need it. We just have to agree first that the girls are the ultimate winners. OK, OK. Girls rule. Now, what do we do? Did you guys think about giving the kids naps? <laughs> sure. Now they're behaving. That's taking the easy way out, if you ask me. Yeah. 
We took them head on. Like men? What? No way! Hi, Wyatt. Oh, hi, Serena. Can I have my bandana back? Okay, what is so important about that bandana? What, it has sentimental value? You miss Chad, don't you? Chad and his special brown stupid bandana. Actually, I'm just having a bad hair day. So why didn't you wear the one I bought you? I'm your boyfriend. Because hockey sticks and pucks don't really go with the rest of my look, in case you didn't notice. Oh, yeah, I figured that. <laughs> right. Guys are such bad liars. Oh, I think not! Guys are definitely better liars than girls. Shut up! Are you crazy? You'll wake the kids.